<laughs> the 8-bit drummer last week I'm said... If, of my word, <laughs> Jared said that um, if I covered Pool Party from uh, Paper Mario, he would donate $100. Joke was on him because I was going to do it anyway, but now I get $100 out of it. I was like, oh yeah, I could see if I could fit that into my schedule. What do I have coming up next? Uh, oh, Pool Party. All right, that works. Here we go! How do I make so many random stream titles? I literally make my stream title the first thing I think of. I don't ever think about it too hard. I literally, like, once I'm about to go live, I'm like, Banjo-Kazooie eats the butt of... Quintil, I don't know. That's what I learned from um, Cards Against Humanity. Like, I would always create these huge big brain jokes, but nobody's gonna fucking think <laughs> that far. It needs to be something that's, like, instantly funny, otherwise it's not gonna work. Shut up! <laughs> what the fuck was all that talking? Shut the fuck up, Nipper! I didn't want to hear your life fucking story. Dude, I just fucking mushroom stamped that Jinjo with Banjo's fucking cock, and he didn't do shit. Oh my good god. Well, I guess we're going up there anyway. <laughs> yeah, the Jinjo was like, nice cock, bro. Mushroom stamp. It's when you fucking imprint your dick into something. It looks like a mushroom. That's what you say. You go, mm, 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 mm. I don't have any ideas for a Halloween cover right now. Like, what's Halloween y that's coming out? I, I mean, there's a Hades kind of or Bloodstained, an Among Us cover. Dude, if there was music in that game, I would. In the beginning. <laughs> Now, uh, putting Among Us in the title of your video doesn't guarantee views. However, if you put Among Us in the title and put IQ 5000, it has a better chance. That's why you see like every video about Among Us from any of the popular YouTubers have like IQ 2000 play, IQ 420, IQ negative 100. All the Among Us content doesn't appeal to me. Why not? I mean, that's fine. I'm just curious. You just wish they'd stop, but that didn't answer the question. Are you just annoyed by seeing so much of it? Oh, you put the answer before. Oh, sorry. I missed it. I do see that, that, that reasoning like for a lot of things though, where they're just like, I just see so much of it and I'm tired of it and I'm like okay <laughs> remember fall guys I hate that whole mentality though people still play fall guys but people like pretend like oh now fall guys is dead it's really a shame and they're trying to like have like a narrative on the way that gaming is right now but it's like no people still play fall guys just because it's not fucking hyper trending like it's always been a thing man it always goes by fast we always go through phases man Fucking shit. Dude, between Among Us and Fall Guys, everyone got beaned, you friggin' idiot. Get beaned. Ever wonder what this stage smells like? I didn't until you just mentioned that and you've just cursed it for me, thank you. I had to beanify the whole cast. Oh, come on! I was laughing at thinking cyberpunk with beans. There's like that whole aesthetic, but every character is fucking like a, a Fall Guy bean. I'm a bean girl. What's up, Nierfenheimer? I wish I was a bean girl. I want out of this sad flesh prison and into a bean girl body. He turns himself into a bean. Funny shit I've ever seen. I really hope the next DLC fighter for Smash is some form of bean character. I want fucking Among Us imposter. Dude, he'd already have like all those fucking cool attacks and shit. Yeah, the imposter would pull out a gun or just fucking cut Link in half. Like, the imposter would be brutal. Who three stocked Link? <laughs> It was Mario. I don't know, man. Prom's looking kind of sus. Why is there an anime titty girl on my screen? Nah, it's just me. Don't worry about it. Also, like, what kind of a world do we live in where somebody's like, um, why is there an anime titty girl on my screen? It's like, dude, bro, don't ask. You're welcome? <laughs> Emotionally, we all have anime titties. I can't agree more. I wear my anime titty on my sleeve. Arm titties, yeah. They're like, you know, bingo wings. I guess more people call them bat wings, but um, I knew somebody who called them bingo wings because they're the, like the folds of skin that flip around when the old people at the bingo game wins. They jump up and down and they scream bingo and their arm flaps just go back and forth and they just fly away. Go, 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 go. Hope the dragonfly isn't there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> No, fuck! I'm doing well, I promise. Because you have to press B to do the chompy, which is faster, but I press B too early, and that's also the transform button. Go until I get the washing machine, yeah. Fuck this run, just go for washing machine percent. Kind of shows that I watched when I was younger. Um, Rugrats a lot, Rocco's Modern Life, a lot of Nickelodeon shows. Oh my god, what a dick! Get up! Time to stretch! Pop a quick squat, gets all the blood going. Yeah, stand up. You gotta do it, man. It's good for your body. You think you got your physique from your ancestors sitting around watching people stream video games all day? You can enjoy the video games better if you've got, you know, good blood flow. What the fuck? No fucking way. Dude, I had it and for some reason I was just like a pixel off. 
I've been pretty consistent with that swag strat of just jumping straight down to it. Oh, okay. What if you miss though? Eh, I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> it's really not worth it for me at this point, but it does feel cool when I get it. Because if I fall off that snowman, the run's fucking over <laughs> pretty much. All right, we got legs. Those have been the source of a lot of dead runs in the beginning. So I'm happy we got that relatively consistent. We lost so much fucking time there. And I have no idea why, because it felt really good. There we go. Oh, I, if, I, if I committed, that would have worked. There we go. No! How? Sometimes this works first try, and sometimes it just fucks me. I personally, I never heard the fuck you that everybody says, like, when Grant says thank you. I've heard in-person Grant Kirkup say fuck you. He's actually told me to get the fuck off his property. It was a pretty magical moment. I get the fuck off my property. <sighs> Okay, sorry, Mr. Kirkhope. I really want to turn this run around, but that PB was too tight, I guess. This is why Duck wants you to learn MMM early. <sighs> I'll learn it eventually. That would technically save like a minute. If I knew MMM early, that would probably pull this run. Get in the... When it just won't go in. MMM early will save that much time because uh, we don't have to spend all that time in the beginning swimming all the way to the Mad Monster Mansion uh, painting because we just get in there without opening it. <laughs> I don't understand. I don't understand what I'm doing wrong. Neopenheimer, I only got the first line of that, which said I tend to shoot my dad and I didn't read <laughs> I didn't read the rest of it. <laughs> Jules is your dad, our dad, comrade. I'm everybody's collective communist dad. Giving me our national anthem. Somebody once told me the world is not gonna thrive under capitalist economics. <laughs> Jericho, I did um, both the Black Eagles routes. Was going through Blue Lions and then I got distracted. What I think is so sick about the writing in Three Houses is like pretty much everyone I know, they loved the first house they chose no matter what and felt like it was canonically the correct one. Whoever you go with, you think the other houses are either dumb or Oh, I just fucked with my note count, but, and my health. Did I just take two? For a split second, I thought the run was over. <laughs> yeah, just don't take damage. Just don't play bad. This is bonkers to me. I'm losing this much fucking time. It's like ridiculous. Why am I losing this much time from the PB? Like it's good, but I know how good I am, you know? We lost a full minute on that. I don't get it. I don't understand how we could have lost that much time. Get it, get it. Oh my God, just get the fucking jiggy. In a normal run, that wouldn't be that that big of a deal. But with the way that like the splits have been looking, I'm just like, this probably is gonna fucking make me lose a minute for some reason. I don't get it. Please work, please work, please work. I need this. No, <laughs> come on. It's so fucking close. It's good, it's good to fucking. That f hurts. <laughs> it just fucking hurts when I miss that, man. <laughs> it's time to play Among Us. When the run goes bad, it's time to play Among Us. Do you have any merch? I'm working on it. I do. Uh, mostly CDs right now, but I still want a, a sad flesh prison shirt. A stupid sad shirt. Yeah, a shirt that just says I'm stupid sad over here. <laughs> bad angle. Let's try that. Fuck you, Banjo. Come on, dude. Come on, Banjo. We've gotten this first try like every other run. There you go. Do you peel your cereal before you eat it? Do you peel your own ass? Yeah, I, I peel my own ass before I eat it. So I peeled it before I ate it for charity. Ass peeling dust. Don't breathe this. Don't fucking fall off the tree. Don't do that. Fuck my ass. Fuck my ass. Please give me the... Oh my God. So that's a four minute time loss. <laughs> Just, I mean, the way that this run's going, now we're gonna be like 10 minutes red <laughs> because of that one thing. Please. Hello. Oh. oh my God, why is it so slow? Van Just picking his ass. We never every fucking worm. <laughs> Damn, I cannot believe how low I am on feathers. This run truly is pretty fucking cursed. What an amazing winter split. Too bad somehow I still lost time. I don't fucking understand. Are you fucking kidding me? Give me a break, dude. Okay. 
Uh, Sab, thank you so much. Really appreciate it. You got this dude. We learn from each attempt, teacher Sab. We do learn from each attempt, that's true. How can collision be real if our eyes aren't real? And I'm inside the eyeball again. I'm screaming from the inside out, personally. The bee screaming is just an extension of myself. Back in the day, the video game screamed when you screamed. Never takes me this long. Come on, dude. No! You... I fucking hate this run, dude. After my luck on the other one, I'm just like... Are you fucking kidding me? And then a picture question? God damn it, dude. Never give up. Never surrender. Ekam Bukum. Ekam Bukum. Just when you think you have a good run, Gruntilda hit to a good old walk and stomp. Uh, yeah, I'm the shit that Gruntilda is stomping down the drain. Where are you going, Grunty? That was weird. Why did she like turn back and then she's got those smooth moves. Grunty and her whatever the opposite of tight body is. Cottage cheese thighs and fucking old expired yogurt ass. She puts the ass in flaccid. <laughs> yes, correct. She got a dump truck. Not only does she have a dump truck, she's got a flaccid dump truck. I should have switched over to averages, man. <laughs>